this particular example, they would give you a word problem, something like there's an airplane flying at an altitude of 10,000 feet. It spots one ship at an angle of depression of 10 degrees and another ship at an angle of depression of 15 degrees. Now, remember, when you talk about angle of depression, what you're talking about is the angle that's down from the horizontal, okay? And when you're talking about angle of elevation, you're talking about the angle that's up from the horizontal. But what's interesting is that the angle of elevation and the angle of depression, these are actually like alternate interior angles. They're congruent. You probably remember this from geometry. So if we know that this angle here is 10 degrees, from this boat here, the angle up or elevate, uh, angle of elevation is also going to be 10 degrees. Same thing here. If this angle is 15 degrees, this angle from this ship up is going to be 15 degrees. Now we want to find the distance between these two boats, these two ships, and uh, let's just call that distance D. This distance here we don't know. Let's just call that distance X. So what we're going to do since we have two variables is we need two equations and we're going to solve that system of equations. Let's start with this little triangle here first. What trig function ties together this angle this side and this side. Well, that's going to be the tangent because the tangent is equal to the ratio of the opposite side over the adjacent side. Now for this larger triangle here, we're going to do the same thing. We're going to say the tangent of 10 degrees is equal to the opposite side, which is 10,000 over the adjacent side, which is X plus D. Okay. Now we have our two equations, our two variables. We can solve the system. So, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to cross multiply. So I'm going to say x times tangent of 15 degrees equals 10,000 times 1. And then I'm going to divide both sides of the equation by tangent of 15 degrees to get x by itself. And let's go to the calculator on this one. It comes out to 10,000 divided by the tangent of 15. Make sure you're in degree mode on your calculator. That comes out to 37320.5 approximately. Okay, so 37,320.5. Now over here, what we're going to do is we're going to take x, what x equals, and we're going to put it in place of x. So what we have now is we have the tangent of 10 degrees equals uh, 10,000 over 37,320.5 plus D. Okay, now we want to solve for D. We just have one variable, one equation. We, what we can do is we can cross multiply again. So 10,000 times 1 is 10,000. Uh, tangent of 10, uh, let's do that times 37,320.5 times tangent of 10. Comes out to approximately 6, uh, 6,580.6 plus Let's see, tangent of 10 times D, which is about 0.176D. Okay, so now we're almost there. We just have to subtract 6,580.6 from both sides, minus 6580.6. So it looks like we're at 3,419.4 equals 0.176D, and divide both sides by 0.176, and you got it. So that comes out to a distance of approximately uh, 19,428 uh, feet. That's the distance between these two boats. So great job. If you like my teaching style and you want to take your learning with me further, I've got an Algebra 1 course, an Algebra 2 course, a huge ACT math review video course, and a huge SAT math review video course. You can check out those courses uh, in the link below there. Um, to go over and check out those courses. So great job. I'll see you in the future videos. I'll talk to you soon.